I'm still in it. I'm still in it. Oh, my jaw hurts. I don't even know what that means. Okay, but I ate a peach. This is the wrong game. I've opened the wrong game. Okay, let's make... A game. With a beginning, middle, and end. That's the wrong thing. Let's do this. <clears throat> So there's two things. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make a uh, uh, beginning, and then an end. No. So I, I'll the fix first. The fix first. So I don't need to check this. So let's do if. Let's just match state. State. State dot dot chase. <clears throat> and then we'll do no. Delta. And for state dot uh, patrol if complete next point move delta. State dot uh, moving. So this is our tour. If it's complete, we do this stuff. And for all of these, we do move. Oh, wait, no. We also do... Uh, wait, no. This is still if complete. And then we move. Else, move. Delta. And then we're going to do, so if, if tethered, tether, check, There we go. And I'm going to do that for moving because and uh, idle. Because if we're tethered, else we set physics process to false. And here. If patrol, and then for being awareness, <clears throat> if we can if see him and make a direct ray to the center of the body, and then these are all applicable. So the reason I think this will fix things is because this complete function is what was taking a really long time, right? But it was only taking a long time because the player was running around in crazy places. But I don't actually care because this isn't applicable. 
and it doesn't do anything when the player is chasing, or when the player is being chased. So this should dramatically improve performance here. It did not. What does that mean, though? Debugger, profiler. Let's start the profiler. I don't know what that means. It's move now. What? Okay, so now it's this. <clears throat> Uh Hmm All right, let's see if I can make a bank uh Let's make a simpler level then. Let's just let's just not make unreachable areas in the level. Uh, I mean, I'm not even doing anything with these with these random fucking pillars. So let's just go to uh, uh, Dark Spire. Let's rethink even my entire approach to this. I don't know what I'm going to do. Also, I'm going to go here. This, this, uh, this one. This is going to be a little guard. So let's get... And he will be idle. And he will be, uh, have this. Uh, and, hmm. All right, let's just get all these pillars out of here. I hate these pillars. Or let's turn them into let's turn them into boxes. Let's just. Selected cube. Let's just uh, make them un in impossible to do anything with there. So now we're going to have... Oh, <clears throat> excuse me.
much simpler, much better looking, more suited to the area. I think uh, I can tell you that those are true. I can simply insist those things. But what I do know is that it makes it less likely that there's unreachable geometry. But then... I still gotta figure out why this is causing so much, so much trouble, though. <clears throat> like, cause can I? Should I just like? I don't know. Make it. You know, cause I'm proud of this fountain. Let's just bring it down. I mean, I didn't even know what I was doing with any of these anyway. All right, what's the actual, what's the game, what's the game going to be? So I think, we need to find a way to get up to here. And it's going to be presumably some sort of tour. So I made a bunch of pillars, wasted a bunch of time. Uh, let's just, let's just make a, like, elevator. Gonna be a lovely elevator. I don't know. This is gonna be the later head. Let's do center of mass. Elevator uh, tail. Get up out of this is head, not heat. <clears throat> so let's put this like here let's have some stairs going up to this thing So let's also have, um, so the issue, I'm just going to, I know, I'm just going to fake it. So this is going to be a pretend thing. Basically, this is a kinematic body, which is not going to be picked up by the navigation mesh, or so. What I'm going to do is just also add 
uh, you know, this other thing, this fake body, this body, because the navigation, the thing will walk up this. I'll show you. So let's close that, close that, uh, NPC, uh, O2. Let's navigate, let's regenerate our navigation mesh. Because our little, poor little guides are going to be gone. While we're doing that, let's do general. We're going to need uh Hang on, I need I need bright I need more light. <laughs> I'm going to make the little pea bodies. They're going to be little funny little guys. I feel like I have fucking rabies. Object, uh, 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 smooth. Oh, man. Hang on. I need to get rid of some of these because I put too many gosh darn things. Don't need this, don't need this. M dissolve X dissolve uh, vertices. X dissolve edges. There we go. That's what I want. So these foul little creatures will be called uh, I don't know what they're called, but they're basically just little peas. They're just little peas that have uh, arms and legs. <clears throat> so let's get their little stupid little legs in there. Let's put little cubes and they'll be like 0 0.05 or whatever.
Um, wait, I don't even have my chat open. Let's pop this out. All right, so we need this, this. All right, I need my Mario model. So push has come to shove. So let's get my file open recent. Oh, wait, I should. Uh, first things first. Let's finish these guys. Uh, little cylinder. Let's just... So if I can do, uh, I will someday. Hmm. Okay, so these are the P bodies. Let's get the same system in place that I've used for everything else. So we're gonna, they're also gonna be NPCs, but they're gonna be friendly, so they're not gonna do anything. Uh, let's do um, cursor to active. Armature. Do I really need a collarbone? Like, is that going too far? Has science come too far? I'm about to puke. Uh, what, uh, why am I even... I guess it must just be, like, getting mad at computers all day has like destroyed my body and mind. Whatever. Let's hide that one for now. Okay. Roots. Roots. Body. Head. Collar.l. For arm. L. That's the wrong button. That's the wrong name. Uh, 
Y.L. Cast L. Uh, foot cut. So this is not a deformed bone. And not a deformed bone. This is also not a deformed bone. little adventure time looking ass. Oh. <clears throat> uh 3D viewport. And then the that and then the dope sheet and then the action editor. Oh wait, I have to first off Most important thing. Uh, this is a knee. And the arms can do whatever they want. Because we're just going to need the, um, the idle and the walk. Let's call it there. And let's very delicately see if I can, like, I want to make it just perfect so that way it actually works. All right, pose mode. It's go time. Going to inverse kinematic to, it's going to go to the heel. And it's going to go to the heel. It's going to go to the knee. It's only going to be uh, two of these. So what's the rule? Let's do 90. What do you know? Perfect. Wait. Gotta make sure. Wait, no. This one... How does this work? Okay. This one, then this one. Oh my god. Okay, hang on. Hide this bone. Control P. Control P. Offset. Alt H. Control Tab. Pose mode. There we go. Okay. Object mode. Uh, selected. No, to world origin. So I'm going to do the same thing that I did for the other one, so only faces. Let's get this awful little thing here. 
to have its own viewport display thing. It's going to be a plane. There's the music. Let's do Night in the Woods soundtrack. So if I can find it. Uh, okay. So if I do Armature Symmetrize, I might just get it to work. Alright. Let's do Close Mode. Uh, do reset. Let's get actually. Before I get too far into that, So we have uh, our seams. These guys look like they're from a completely different universe. They don't have any coherency whatsoever with the other guys, but that's okay. do uh, automatic weights, see if that works. And if it doesn't, I'll just ignore it. Uh, let's do... Uh, I won't. I won't ignore it. It's because we needed, a, we needed a bone right there. In fact, I got that one right there. That's fine. So let's do... Automatic weights. Let's see if what it does again. Yeah, good enough. Who cares? Okay, so we need the idle loop. So we're going to stash that. Do stick. Let's do in front. Weird little alien things. So we need 60 FPS. So they're going to go down. So it's gonna, they're going to go down a little bit. Right there. Oh, I forgot the uh, most important thing. So this one has an inverse kinematic to the armature uh, toe. It's only one. And this one will have a similar thing.
Oh, but it'll be to the right toe instead of the left one. There we go. I would like oh, I shouldn't have done that, but that's okay. So what I'm going to do instead is here. So right about here, these arms are going to be in as much as they should be. really bizarre. Okay, that's good enough. So we'll favor that stash that new Walk, loop. So this one will be 60. So it'll be just a just a good old fashioned uh, one of these numbers. So this arm is going back, <clears throat> this arm is going forward, and also these little disgusting little creatures will have their arms like flip-flop. Okay, so at like 15... major production to get these little gangly little fellows to oh, wait no wait no hang on this guy's bending his arms forward this guy's bending his arm this one's bending his arms backward okay This isn't even like part of the this isn't even an important part of the game. I just I guess I just want to make this. I want to make I need to make little Peabody guys. Let's make a new collection for this though. So I need let's go to 15. Let's put down this heel contact. We'll do it a little bit down like that. Now 
And I guess this one's going all the way back now. It'll be all the way bent, and this one will be all the way forward. And that's about as far as it bends back. In fact, it'll be... Okay, and then let's copy those. Uh, not quite. I want more bend right here. Right here, I should say. And then let's do a graph editor. And let's just, uh, <clears throat> let's see, does this need to be? Yeah, I think we can just chop this up. And if I change this to 59 instead of 60, Let's change that back, actually. So let's hide this from here, and let's get everything else. Is there something back? No, there's nothing back there. This is probably one of my best walk animations yet. But okay. It's also running at about half speed. What are the other animations that I needed? So I have idle, I have walk. I would need capture if I wanted to make them capture, but I don't. So what I'll do is it, I'll just make a... Let's do action, dope sheet, action editor. Stash that. New, capture. Excuse me for my weird burp. It sounded like a pig. And I'm realizing my headphones. My headphones are what's causing the problem. I don't usually have my headphones in for so long. It's causing just a little bit of extra pressure on the temples of on my temples. Okay. But this should be good. Because now these Peabodies are here. So let's do a uh, new object mode. UV mode, I should say. V editor. New 356 by 256.
Okay. Let's GLB export. Remember me, data, mesh, uh, material, placeholder. Let's do texture paint. Fill it with gas. Where's the paint? Where's the colors? There's colors up here. Where'd they go? This is beyond my pay grade. Blender, texture, paint. Where is the color? I think this is going to be what does me in... I don't know how to handle this. Because I feel physically ill already. So I'm not excited for the prospect of trying to figure out what's wrong with this fucking thing. Like, there's just no fucking, there's just no, there's just nothing. There's just no paint. I don't know how to do, I don't know how to do. Because it's like, did I just press the please delete the fucking button button? Texture paint. Color is gone. What did I... Hang on. So I'm, I'm painting this one. Oh, okay, wait. Hang on. Okay, it's here, though. There's a backup color picker. Hang on, we're still in business, maybe. There we go. So now I'm going to do. Let's do. These are going to be like orange. That's good enough for me. For that at least. So now. Oh, wait, no. Damn it. Well, how do I get the color picker? Is there like a, a history? Like I need, I need, okay. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna use a different color. Cause Let's make it brighter. I like brighter color. I like brighter green. So. I don't want to. The, the, the thing. The thing is gone. 
Maybe I can do texture node editor? No. I think it's because I delete... Did I... Is that... Did that happen with this model where I accidentally deleted the original 3D viewport? Like, is there a different 3D viewport that's slightly different that has the toolbar at the top? Is it like... Is it like this? Hang on. No, that's not it. Okay, because I also need... I need to get... Okay, whatever. Let's just get a little... Uh, I don't care. Let's just grab this. Grab this. Individual origins. Scale all of them down a little bit. Scale this one down a lot. Why is this one so weird? What even is that? Like, there's so many things like this. Like, why is this all fucked up? It's just, like, exhausting trying to deal with Blender, like, insisting that what I really, really need is to have all of my textures right... all of my UV islands right next to each other, and then the texture to bleed over, like, by 500 miles. Whatever. I don't need that. I don't need that negativity. negativity is good for me. It's the only way I can cope. So this is going to be the default one. Just always worried. That's Peabody. So that's Peabody 1. Let's see what they look like. They're pretty good. Pretty good. Okay. Inherited. So the first one is going to be named Peepipo. Uh, that's not what they look like. There we go. Alright, let's rename this. Inherited. The uh, three and a me active. NPC. Um, let's just call it Peabody. Because they're all going to be the same except for a few things. So we need PC.
then uh, shape. Let's do if nav dot has get dot is navigation else move. So chase and patrol require kinematic bodies because I'm gonna I'm gonna have a funny gag that I'm gonna do. Uh, and honestly, I don't even care if I get the actual game done. I want to get the funny things done. So let's get this. So this collision shape. So this collision, collision, um, what's it going to be? Let's get area, shape, awareness, so I'm just going to add these just so that it's satisfied. So this is a uh, capture. Because these are going to be sorely missed by the thing here. I also need my interaction. This will be where it always is. <clears throat> I'm gonna die. I feel like I'm gonna die. But as long as I get P Frank in here, because there's there's P Pi Po, P Plum Pink, and P Frank. And then there's the Morrow brother, the Martin brothers. I'll put them in as well. Maybe. You know what? Let's get let's get my Mario. File open recent. Where's Mario? Mario, uh, open. It was in my. Uh, I was working because I was working on. Do Jack Four. Marketing Devlog for Blend Morrow. All right, look at this. 
Here's Mario. He exists. So this is this is now Martin. Oh, so I'm gonna let's remove the sub. Let's not remove the subdivision. Let's have it. Okay, so they're both one. <laughs> he looks terrible. He looks so bad. <laughs> Image save as NPC Martin. Uh. Forgot to hang on. <laughs> I'm just going to have him write. So I have these two mesh instances. They're going away. Also, this is just going to be um, a spatial. Well, no. I can keep these. I'm just going to remove these. So let's put Martin. And Martin. Hey. Are they the right size? They're not the right size. They are still too big. Oh, wait, no. I need to make sure. Yeah, there we go. Where's my Martin and Martin? They're the greatest in the world at what they do. So we need <clears throat> So we need P Pipo. Let's get um P body new inherited scene. Uh, as soon as I get the script. Now we can do it.
Why are his feet all screwed up? Oh, it's because they run at 15... It's because the animations were imported at 15 FPS, now that I realize. Okay, that's fine. Uh, new inherited scene. E I O. Typo, and they are going to have their. Uh, uh, make unique. Make them slightly that. So that is now going to be E I Po T S C N Square Too tall. Also these guys are a little too small. Okay, there we go. Close all tabs. E body. Uh, zero zero. And we are going to start at the start. Oh one. So P Frank is going to be way over somewhere else. But where's P Pi Po? What's our script say about this? Happy Po intro. <laughs> You're so bad. Ugh. Okay. Where's Peppy Po? Project MD's NPC Peppy Po. Let's get the plum pink. Save. Okay. So P plum pink gonna be a delightful plum pink. I don't know what plum pink is. I'm assuming a pinkish purple that's not super bright. Then I'm going to get a fancy black. Not really fancy. And then I'm going to do uh, paint. 
Oh wait, my tablet's working now. Sort of. <clears throat> Get a Peabody. New inherited scene. No, wait, no, wrong one. P plum. Unique. Oh, that looks that looks that looks like I like I did it on purpose. <clears throat> so let's get P plum pink dialogue. Frank intro. Oh, that's P Frank. How dare you. A ploopy. And then, last and certainly not least, we need P. Frank. Let's make these like a denim. In fact, let's get a denim texture. Let's get this in here. Let's get this in here. Nice image. Where's my image? <clears throat> there we go. Oh, I'm thinking of Blender. The things. Hang on. God fucking damn it. Control A. Delete. Copy image. Shift control N. There we go. enough for me. Alright, let's get this How does this work? Oh, I'm in the wrong layer. That's how it works. Okay. A 
let's do so P plum or P Frank is gonna be just an orange color. And let's get this. So where's P Frank in all this? We need to find him. We need to set him free. So I think he's going to be... Right there. We found him, boys. What's the dialogue? Intro. Frank intro. So we need... Let's just get in a Peabody in here. So he's gonna be P Frank. And we're gonna make his children editable. So that way we can have um, his, just his regular little body. New... There's P. Frank. Now let's get him over here behind everybody else. Also, let's go to NPC, next item, point, oh wait no, okay, I already do what I want, because I don't want him tethered to anybody, So because he's going to go off into the sunset, he's going this way, he's going to uh, go to uh, position 3D, Oh. He has one. Now let's see if I can get this working. Frank intro. So it's not going to be event Frank Leaves, it's going to be main, speaker, next point. And also... Okay, let's start a new game. Oh wait, if... Not now. I know, if... Nav... And... I need an important thing. Where's my little guy? So, P. Pi Po, uh, do they not have their interactions?
Ah, they don't. Critical error on my part. Sir, oh. It's been so long since I've actually played the game that I forgot to actually, like, do things. Okay. But also, now that this is in the wrong place. So I need... The last thing will be a little statue area. They look so bad. They look so terrible. And they're so huge, too. Now, important. Important thing here. P. Frank. God damn it. Wait, no. If nav. Okay, all I need... Why is this here? Okay, let's go back to global. When did I change the change level to? Let's... Game state... No. Set stats level... Okay, so I need to, eventually I'll need to fix that, but that's okay. God damn it. Return, nav. I know. If nav. else. Return. Node. And. Return not target node or Okay. Okay, and we have loaded into the level correctly. <clears throat> if nav and He needs to be sh he needs to be way slower. I think the pea bodies need to be like they need to move at like three meters a second. They need to move at like two, actually. 
Actually, no. I think only... Only P. Frank. He'll move at like one meter a second. <laughs> that was the joke. That was the joke I wanted. <laughs> What a wonderful, what a wonderful, actually, hang on, let's get a wonderful, oh wait, I didn't even get the debug stuff hidden, oh well. Let's get a cool action shot, so that'll be, alright, well, if I'm dead by tomorrow. So we have we have the important things in why did I turn off my power shell? Oh, wait, I know the last thing that I'm going to do. 3D. Uh, let's just let's just make a different material. So let's just do like <laughs> What's our materials here? I mean, I guess I can just do tile for the ground for the ceiling metal one for the wall mm -hmm. and I'm gonna put a uh, prompt so let's do I know I know last thing that I'm gonna do so Control. Gaming. Let's hide this in here. Let's put a little prompt. Prompt. Uh, <clears throat> Let's do like a panel container. Label, and that label is going to say interact. And it's going to have spacing on either side, and this is going to be visible in the the center bottom whenever uh, let's go to player interact Indicator dot hide gaming slash talk dot hide go okay so there's just gonna be a UI prompt uh, oh right. 
UI slash modal slash game. Debug will be Oh, it uh, doesn't go the right way. Because we need size flags. No, grow direction. Begin. Can you talk to him still? Nope. He doesn't even know how to go. Oh, you you can block him. Sort of. All right, whatever. Let's see our stupid fucking Goombas or whatever. So we need to go into the castle. We need to talk to the guy, and then we need to. So yeah, whatever. I got th I got my one joke that I wanted. Durian guy. <clears throat> Uh, let's just say, you know what? So... All right, that's an ending if I've ever... <laughs>
D. Frank is my greatest creation. I just think it's so funny to have you as the player saying something and a character just walks away while you're while you're saying it. Like just walks away while you're choosing the reply. That's just such a funny idea to me. Uh, what? Huh? That's not supposed to happen. Oh well. All right. Ah, now isn't that a delightful experience? I think many players will enjoy this. All right, let's do, uh, uh, oh, fuck me. I have to actually, like, release it now. Well, there's only going to be a Windows build. Let's do, um... Project export project. Do I even have a build? All right, let's do close that. That seems to be functional. Finishing touches, no nothing. Uh, perfect stuff there. Great stuff here. Uh, no, no, no. Peabody's good. That's good. What's this? That's good. Uh, let's not save that. I don't care. So I need CDC tools. So, let's spin. Hmm. Okay, I don't have any tools, so target. Dons, tools equals yes, target equals lease. Uh, J12. No, tools equals no. And I think NP profile equals no. Let's see if that makes sense. All right. So that's now off to the races to compile. Okay, that's going to be... Unless I wake up early, bright and early tomorrow, that's going to be the game. It's going to be the game that you will get to play. You get, you walk, you do one sort of dialogue puzzle, you get to talk to like four people. Uh. Alright, uh, uh, see you later.